Hello friends. Welcome back to Bamboo Land. We're making bamboos tonight. Every night. Bamboos. Only bamboos. This is going to be an unusual composition. But it's late. I've been bambooing for a while. It's time to get rowdy. Hey, get quiet. Let it go on heat. Fun composition. Adding a little bit of being the forbidden, adding dirty water into the well. Something about this feels very, very wrong. But it's just ink water, it doesn't feel that wrong. <laughs> so we added a big splash of water to this ink well. Now the dark we had a quite serious dark in there. It's going to be quite diluted, although that's not always the case. Sometimes, when you're kind of deep into your painting session, as I am right now, there's just a lot of ink that gets built up, both in the well and in your dirty water, in your brush, and sometimes you just need even a lot of water can leave you with a dark color. Let's see what we have here. I'm going to predict that we have a dark color here. Oh, I'm wrong. <laughs> it's very pale. Good. That's very wet. It's going to get much paler um, when it dries. Oh, well, looks like I have some inadvertent sprinkles here. Okay. So we're going to do a, a pale layer. Where would be a good place for some pails to go? Let's add the third leaf pale, see how it looks. Third leaf, third leaf. Fourth leaf pale, fourth leaf, fourth leaf. Do you see that these are kind of, these clumps are mirror images of each other, right? These are facing this way, these are facing this way. They travel up the up the ladder. So I like to think of it. This is so funny. It's turned into a little bridge. Where can we take it? What can we do next? I can also put in big stems, but that's what I'll do. I've done that before. Maybe another one. Seems a little more plausible. <laughs> This is how this one looks. 
definitely looks like something. Also, it looks like bamboo. I don't know how I would improve it. Definitely looks like something, though. The way I think about it, whether it looks like bamboo or not, we can learn something from it. When we look at something that doesn't look how we want it to look, that doesn't look pretty, we can start to think about what are the things about it that make it not look good. And then, once we identify those things, we can not do them in the future. So I'm going to think about what could be improved in this picture, in this composition. How would it have been made better? What could I have done differently that would have been better? Maybe if you think about it too, if you have some ideas, you can leave a comment. Thanks for watching. Good night.